Hey everybody, it's Akisha 1981. I am still high. Let me let this window up. Y'all, last week I hit my one year uh, couponing anniversary and my stockpile was looking so fit pitiful because I've been so busy. And I said I'm going to start, you know, hitting the couponing scene again like I used to. I was at work when I started hearing about all these great deals, the mega deals at uh, Kroger, the Overage, um, at Target and Walmart and all this. And so I was so anxious to get home and start doing some of the deals. Whenever I do like couponing hauls, I like to give myself like a budget. Like if I was like, okay, I just need to pick up a few things. My budget is, you know, get $20 after... Um, rewards, gift cards, out of pocket. I want to, you know, stay at my $20 or under budget. If I need, you know, a little bit more, I might say 30 but I needed a lot. I wanted my stockpile to look full and to have things that I need for, you know, when I run out, I don't have to be trying to run to the store like I was about to start doing on the body wash. I was like out of body wash for my husband and I had started, I was like, shit. I do not want to just run out and pay full price or just, you know, get maybe a dollar off or 50 cents off of one little coupon. You know, I want to work some deals. And then I start uh, hearing about Target and all the Gillette. And when I got to the Target, I saw the Dial gift card deal. I got four big bottles of Dial for like $3. And I'm like, cool. So, um, I spent, I ended up spending under fifty dollars it ended up, ended up being around the forty two dollar range and i got so much stuff i mean my stockpile looks full i got some new products that i've been wanting to try but if the coupon hadn't been good or i wasn't able to do the deal because i was at work or for whatever reason i finally started getting more stuff uh, last deal with the toilet paper at alberson i was able to get like 40 or 50 packs last December and I had just got down to my last like few so uh, that tells you how much toilet paper we go through and it's just me and my husband that's sad but um, I got enough toilet paper at least to last for at least a year at least a year and when I get home on Tuesday last day of the deal I'm going to run out and I'm going to get more but oh uh, to get all the stuff that I got for under 50 bucks man I was like I can't believe I got that much stuff it had I hadn't done a deal like that in God knows how long <laughs> I needed that because I was like my pipe stockpile looking so pitiful and we running low on stuff and uh but whenever I do such good deals like that I get high like can't nothing like bring me down just free toilet paper, free pants. I was like, I got like a thousand free packs of pants. <laughs> well, a thousand pens total. You know, I got so many uh, 10 packs. It's ridiculous. I got so many four packs, but I was like, they're free. I stocked up on pants. I still had probably about 15 or 20 packs from last year with the big deal. Uh, the dollar coupon. They were on sale everywhere for 50 cents or a dollar. But y'all... I'm so glad I was able to get all that stuff that I got. The toilet paper, the cereal, thank you, Vetta. I didn't do the Nestle water deal. I don't, we don't really like the Nestle water. Just because, you know, it's free, you know, don't necessarily mean I get it. If I just, if it's free and I just like, you know what, I got so much, I don't want no more. Or I can get it for free, I just don't want it. I don't get it. A lot of times, you know, if it's new and it's you know free I'll get it try it out I might like it if I don't like it I'll give it away or you know I might use it you know sit on my stockpile you know I might I might need it or my husband might go in there and grab it but the Nestle water he doesn't like it I don't like it it is water but I don't know and I have like no water at home that's sad but I don't know I might do the deal later shit we can't find a good price for water. I'm not going to buy no water in no $4 or $5 a, a pack. I'm not doing it. You know, I'll suck it up and use that and add some flavoring or something to it and be like, Shh, oh well, you can't taste it. 
water. You can just taste the flavor or something. But I might do the deal when I get in. I don't know, but y'all, I did such great hauls. I was only at home for three days before I had to head back out to work. I'm at work now. But um, I hope I hope there's I can get some coupons for the Lysol. I, I wasn't able to do the Kroger Lysol. I got like five of them, and that was it. I could not find those booklets anywhere at Walgreens. Those cold and flu. So I'm going to go back and try it again, go to different Walgreens, see if I can come across those booklets, and hopefully I'll be able to find some Lysol at uh, Kroger. I think they have some in because nobody seems to be able to find the booklets now. So they probably stocked their shelves. But y'all, I did good. I did good. I'm, I'm happy. I'm under 50 bucks and I got all that stuff. And I'm still going to get some more free stuff. So if I feel, I'm feeling good right now. <laughs> y'all, know any good deals that's coming up? I looked at the Target ad, the Kroger ad for next week. I don't really see much of anything, but hey. I might be missing something. And the stores always have um, deals that's not placed in the ad. So, I'm going to have to check it out for myself. Any comments, questions, y'all? Y'all let me know. Bye.